I will talk more about Shadow once we get to Shadow, but Shadow's a whole nother ball game. So, like I said, I do not hate Sonic 06. Oh, cutscene. Was moved to another location. Get it? It's a sign. Get it? To the city. I don't know if it's me or it's 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 this game or something else. I always thought of that like a like a Mario reference. Like the princess is in another castle. It's like, wow, Sonic, this edgy, extreme, awesome guy. Who's like I'm? I'm so much cooler than than um uh, than Mario. Um, pretty much this whole plot is a Mario plot. It's Eggman takes the princess and Sonic gets to go get her. Oh, and trust me, we have to get her a lot. Oh yes, and it ends up in a romance. Ugh. Ah yes, this part of the game. Oh, there, there goes my, there goes my phone. I'll get it. Uh, hold up. Uh. All right. Uh, got a recording. Jeez. So there's a little girl stuck on this roof over here, and everyone doesn't know what to do about it. And the point is, you're supposed to, you're supposed to squeeze on through this, but we don't have the methods to do that. So, with our newfound money, which you get from each mission after you complete it, you need to go buy more junk. So, let's head on back to the store and see if we can buy anything new today. Anti-grav. That doesn't make any sense. Allows you to use sliding. By sliding, you can attack enemies while moving. Why is it called anti-grav? That kind of that kind of defeats the purpose. That doesn't sound like something I would use it for. Anti-grav sounds like I just make everything fly into the air. Sounds like a thing Silver should have, but doesn't. So, how you do anti-grab is you you hold X and this happens. Look at Sonic slide. Look at that slide. Yeah. Elvis Presley slide. That's a, that's a slide. Anyway, there is a way to glitch. <laughs> there is a way that you don't even have to use the anti-grab feature and just pretty much glitch right on through the wall. And it's pretty much like, what the heck just happened? What the heck just happened? Because I've seen it multiple times in other playthroughs where they like glitch through the wall and it's like, oh, I wish I could do that. I really wish I could do that. Anyway, with that, once you complete that quest, there are guards in the way of the next level, so that's why we just did that. The little girl is saved, and we can move on to the next level, which is Gerudo Desert. It's not even right. It's not even... <laughs> Gerudo Desert, that's it. You're a good girl, Elise. Remember, be brave. Don't cry, no matter what happens. Mr. Sonic! Just call me Sonic. Now then, are you okay? I'm so glad that you came. I always keep my word. Sonic! It looks like a pesky rat has stuck its nose where it doesn't belong. Well, a hedgehog to be more precise. The princess is mine. Until I unlock the secret of the flames of disaster. Tails! Got it! Let's go! You think Eggman would have learned? You think Eggman would have learned his lesson when he tried to tamper with chaos, but no, he's trying to touch these flames of disaster. You think, please reconnect controller. That never happens. Actually, that happens all the time. The battery pack gets loose in the back and just pops out. Anyway, Egg Server is our first boss fight. Ah, and our three main heroes we get to play as later. Yay, Silver and Shadow. Yay! No! Silver sucks, and Shadow's okay. <laughs> I don't mind playing a shadow. It's just his levels start out really hard. Anyway, 
Jesus. Back to Sonic, the Egg Cerberus fight is easy. All we have to do is jump on his, get on his horn and throw him into walls or something like that. I'm not sure. It's hard to explain. It's not hard to explain at all. Pretty much he's going to charge at you a couple times and there's going to be points where you rest and that's when you can jump on his tail and get to his horn. And once you're on his horn, you'll be able to navigate him here. Here we go. You'll be able to navigate him into walls, but if you navigate him into these statues, it knocks his health down a lot more. See, we already got him like down to half health. So that's pretty much the gist of this boss fight. Grab on and hope you can kill him. So I think since we knocked down a big chunk of his health, he's actually going to enter a different phase. So the problem with Sonic 06 is that the camera, it, oh, it's, it's doing it now, but it's not focusing on the boss fight itself. So you're constantly wondering where he might be or like where he's going to be charging at and stuff like that since it's a pain in the butt. It's more actually I would say it's it's the thing it's really prevalent in this fight. All the other fights are yeah, see. He'll try to like twist you so there's certain points where you're like, "Yeah, I can do it." But yeah, just ram him into a wall. It might take one more hit before I kill him. Yeah, so this is the the first phase of the boss. He'll actually he'll actually let you lead him into the thing all the time. But by like the second phase, he'll be more like, "I don't want to hit the wall. I'm not doing that. You can't make me." Like I said, the, the camera's not focused on the boss, so it's hard to see where he is. So you're constantly trying to make the camera fix itself to see where he is now. He jumped up to the thing. This is the only time you really focus. The, there's a couple of boss fights that actually focus, but we're not to those boss fights yet. I think... I think... Uh, no, Silver, no. I was gonna say, I think every character fights this boss, but that's wrong. Because I don't think Silver fights him. Okay, I obviously hit that wall. Okay, hit something. Hit something. All right, game. Whatever. Oh, okay. So don't work with me, game. <laughs> not gonna let. Not gonna make me hit. Ugh, not. Ugh. I guess I needed to do it a different way, and it was. I didn't do it correctly. So this boss is taking longer than it should. Egg Cerberus. That's not even correct. He only has one head. Hold, hold the... What the... I've never seen that before. <laughs> oh my gosh, what happened? <laughs> I went to the moon, <laughs> and I died. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm keeping that. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was insane. That's not supposed to happen. I tried a homing attack his tail, and instead of instead of homing attack it, I launched off his tail. What the heck? That's why I love Sonic 06. It's amazing. <laughs> I wish I could. I hope I can get more like that, but I doubtful. I'm very doubtful. That's that's one for the record books. I hope this. I hope this doesn't. I hope this doesn't. Hope my files don't get corrupted. That would suck. Cause that's a reaction you can't get nowhere else. Probably on Game Grumps, so you could probably get one like that on Game Grumps. That attack is worthless since I've never been hit by it. Alright, yeah, turn around. We can hit you with the other statue. Like I said, you gotta reset the camera a lot. Oh, sweet, two, two hit kill. See? That's how you're supposed to do it. I think that should be an S rank, unless I needed more rings. Unless I needed more rings. Up, oh, Cyberus is down. Well, he's not really a Cyberus, because Cyberus has three heads and not one. Eggman doesn't know the difference between a Cerberus and not, and he's supposed to be an IQ of like 10,000 or something like that. And with that, we beat the egg, Cerberus. And S rank, please? Yes? Maybe? An A. An A! After the crap I went through, after I shot to the moon, I demand the Russian judge who I hate that guy.
I hate that guy with a passion. Alright, let's save. I don't want to lose my data. You can you can manually save, but uh, cutscene. How long is this gonna go on? Let's split up. I'll get their attention, and you take the princess. Okay, you be careful, Tails. Leave it to me. Hold on tight. Okay. I think it'd be funny if um if it's like Tails, it's like Tails, Tails is like, I'll I'll go I'll go draw their attention, and they're like, he's like, oh, guys over here, and they're like, they're like, there's the princess over there, can't we just go after her? It's like, yeah, well, why are we bothering with this stupid fox? It's like, yeah, all right, guys, everyone after Sonic and the princess. So, dusty desert. Ugh. We get our first Sonic and Elise section. So Sonic harnesses the power of this I don't know, like 18 year old girl, and he uses it to create the fire shield. With this fire shield, we... You're not supposed to... You're... Bleh, what, are you, what am I trying to say here? Pretty much... That's not how you do it. Pretty much with the fire shield, you're not supposed to... You're supposed to use it to protect yourself against sand, since Sonic will automatically sink right into it if you don't have the shield equipped. And the shield won't last forever, and... In, in fact... In fact, um, it burns the little meter in the right corner, so... Don't get too crazy with it. Also, it looks like Sonic uses Elise for the homing attack. I always thought that was funny. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, take Elise! Take Elise! <laughs> That's how I saw it. I know he's like kicking them with his feet, but it looks like... It looks like he's slamming Elise's body into them. It's just stupid looking. It's a dumb looking animation. I don't like... I don't think... think... Mm, yeah. I think when you travel here with Shadow and, um, oh, gosh, Silver. I'm gonna have to do the glitch to get past that section. I'm not ready for that section. Anyway, back to Dusty Desert. I think Sonic's one of the few people who actually do the outside of Dusty Desert. Most of the people stay inside where the temple is. And I hit a wall. That's amazing. I wanna go to the moon again. Let's do that. The Sonic Adventure 2 is up there, and that's, that's, I've never beaten that game, so... I've only... If you want, like, a Sonic history with me, it's, um... Oh, gosh, I'm about to sink. Ugh. It's, um... My first Sonic game I beat was Sonic Adventure 1, and then after that, it was, like... I played Sonic Heroes, but I never beat it, and then I played... What do you call it? Uh... Shadow the Hedgehog, but I never beat that. And then... Eventually, I played... Sonic Unleashed on the Wii, or the play yeah, the PlayStation 2 version of Sonic Unleashed, and I did beat that game, but I never beat the HD version of it, and they're com two completely different games. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. I think I'm stuck down here. Oh, no, wait, no, I'm not. I'm like, oh, my gosh, why would you do this to me? Sonic Team, why? At least I got a 1-up. Anyway, so it's... And then after I, I did beat Sonic Colors, that took, like, a day to beat. That game is not very long. That game is not very long at all, unless you're going after the Red Rings, then it's like stupid long. Anyway, after I did that, I did... I beat Sonic Generations. And then I remember... I remember hearing about this game. Like, it was a long time ago. Before... Before, like, Game Grumps and them all did it. It's like Some Call Me Johnny review and all, like, the original Some Call Me Johnny review. Uh, I don't know why I mentioned him. He doesn't watch this. <laughs> I wish. That'd be fun. But it was that original review, and I remember seeing it, I'm like, wow, this game looks like it sucks. And then a couple years later, when I finally got my own source of income, it was like, I'm gonna... Wow, Sonic jumps like he's on the moon. Whoosh. Oh, what the heck? I couldn't control my... I couldn't control my... My jump movement in air there for a second. There we go. Yeah. You don't even need the platforms, just stand on the edge of the other thing. So, um, that's when I bought this, and it took me about, like, 
I say like two years to beat this game. Only because I got bored, uh, only because I got frustrated at it, I'm like, I'm not doing this anymore. I think it was around like silver or like shadows sections. Yeah, so this was Dusty Desert. It's pretty much a desert. You see those shiny little silver medals everywhere in this game? You don't need to collect them, but if you do collect them, they get you an achievement. That's it. I actually completed Dusty Desert without dying. That's rare, because normally, normally when I play the stage, I always die. I always die. I always like die during like certain sections like I'll run out of the shield or something like that and just be like oh I fell through no anyway with that we get two little emblem little Soliana coins or whatever they're called of course I want to save of course I want to save oh cutscene <laughs> 